All right, so we're separated from Tess and Ellie, and we're stuck in the museum with uh, I think there's like there's like two two clickers in this area. Um, but first, we want to go to uh, the left here and use a shiv on this door. This was one of the main reasons why I re recorded this chapter because. I got to here on my first run on the recording and I didn't have a shiv. And I've always had a shiv when I got into the store, so this was one of the main reasons why I re, re recorded this chapter. Because there's a lot of good supplies in there. There's some ammo and there's some health items and some yes. building supplies. Um, yes. There's. Fortunately, nothing else in here. Um, I think... I don't know about Survivor, but I believe under Survivor, there's usually at least like two other things you can pick up in here. But... Once you're here, um, then I end up not having a, a throwable. Um, you want to avoid using the bow I just picked up um cause going into the next area you wanna have as many throwables because you're gonna be fighting a ton of infected and being able to basically two hit them you know throw a bottle or hit them with a bottle and then punch them out um makes the fight go very quickly but here very very slowly crouch walk up here um, and then when you get up here and when you open the door if you just run to the door and hit triangle you can completely avoid having to deal with this guy because Joel just goes in the animation of taking open the door. And then you just don't have to deal with, with that asshole. Um, I I think I saw... I uh, Again, I think I saw someone speedrunning the game and they did that. And I was like, huh, I never knew that was the thing. So, I've just incorporated it into my... Into my runs every time I play through the game. Um... You know, between the PS4 and the PS3 versions, I've uh, I've done this story like about like six times, I think, and I unfortunately took a lot more hits during this fight than I than I'm used to taking, cause I ended up kind of getting in a jam where I had guys like on both sides of me, and I couldn't run away quick enough, but. My strategy is just running around trying to grab like a bottle or a brick and just use it on the guys, um, punch them out, throw it at them. I kind of got fucked by the game because usually if you're close enough to the, the guy, the, the game just kind of warps you like right at the guy to start hanging them. But me, because there were two of them so close together the game couldn't decide who who they wanted to have me connect with so but once those guys are done um if there's any bottles or bricks to pick up grab one and uh i'll be uh dealing with actual humans human soldiers 